my gosh, that's one. Fish I came here for. Thank you, fellas. Well, oh, 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 oh my god! Oh my god! It's a monster record! Because that has to be a world record. Bright and early yesterday, we departed Trinidad for a 90 mile journey to the beautiful island of Grenada. We quickly settled into Port Louis, and even though the day didn't allow it due to the time it took to reach here and then immigration and all that stuff, we still managed to get out and squeeze in a couple hours of fishing. Good action, don't need you. Throw many back there. Throw many back there, big man. We had high expectations, but unfortunately didn't have much to show for our efforts. A couple of groupers, snappers, and blackfin tuna were landed on the slow jigging setup. A tuna, yes? The <laughs> <laughs> tuna! Oh yeah, the yellow mouth! <laughs> this morning we're heading out again, but to a different area. We're gonna be using the deep drop rigs again, which is the electric reels, along with hooks and bait. And then we're gonna be doing slow fish jigging as well, which is Chad Ross and myself. We're going to be using very big jigs. The hunting grounds that we're looking for is anywhere from 400 feet to 1200 feet. So we're going to be jigging very deep. As you all already know, I'm real big on the jigging, so I'm going to mostly be doing that. However, bringing a jig up from that depth of water, far less of fish, could be really fatiguing. So we're going to see how well the boys jigging hold up. It's been a smooth run out to the grounds and we just found a beautiful drop off the 800 feet of water. We're gonna take our time, rig our gears, get our hooks all set up and it's time to find out if they have some fish down there. So me being the impatient one, I obviously dropped my jig first because I couldn't take it anymore. Once I got down to the sea floor, it really didn't take long and I hooked up a fish. Now this fish is basically gonna tell us if we're gonna stay here or not. If it's a good fish, well, the boy's gonna be going down again. If not, guess we're gonna be looking for a new spot. On the way down, huh? Make sure that small girl has ready cap. Is that right? Queen in me, Dilele. Queen snapper. Nice one. A nice queen, too, boy. Yeah. Don't go down there, I'll try and get it out of this one. Nice queen snap on the first drop of the day on the Silk Ocean P2.5 jigging Woo! with the boys. With a quality fish in the boat, the decision has been made. We're staying in this spot. Now everybody needs to tie up their jigs and tie up their baits and we're going to go down and see what else is up for offer. <laughs> yeah, that is nice fish dog. You get it? I thought you was hard there. Oh yes, Chad. Oh yes, Chad. Set, dip set. Raise him, raise him, raise him. Raise him. That is a good one. Raise him, Chad. Raise him. Oh my gosh, he's standing up on you. He's standing up on you. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. Oh, he's smoking. No, no, no. Smoking, but he click on. No, no, no. But he click on. No. Brett. Wait, but he click on. He gets smoke. Come on, Chad. That's a beautiful fish, Chad. Chad hooks into a mouse of a fish and in case you didn't know what a mouse of a fish was anything that Trinity's call a mouse fish it just means it's a big fish and this fish starts to smoke the line off of his reel now I'm looking across at Chad and he's putting on a hell of a fight and then this happens to me yes Chad watch that rod behind you hey 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 big oh there's the one oh my gosh that's you one. Big Mike, pull up to that camera now. That's it, Chad. Chad! 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 Yeah, yeah. Chad. <laughs> we in them, Chad. We in them. That's it, fellas. Too big to stop. Too big to stop. Pause, I can't stop this fish, you know. 
Chad, Chad, tell him river it. I can't, this fish is just going. <laughs> Forget it, he drop break off your heart. <laughs> Reverse! <laughs> Chad, I can't get, I can't do anything with this fish. I cannot do anything with this fish. I'm having a good one myself. Chad, <laughs> does he fit? Does he show us how hard on the fish of our lifetime on a jig, brother? <laughs> Look at this! This is ridiculous! What am I doing? My fish is in a hole for sure. I think mine is too. Both of our fish are in a hole. You gotta go on the next side. Go on the next side. Yeah, my fish are You're good, you're good. Chad and myself are hooked up on two big bottom fish. And somehow, these two fish drag us into holes and we both get hung up. After some time, I don't know how we did it. I don't know if it was luck. Some may say it was skill. We got these two fish out of the holes. I'm off the ground. Go reverse. Go reverse. We good. We good. Both of our fish are off the ground. I think. This is amazing fish. This is the best fish that I've ever seen in my life. I can't. Us, Chad. This fish is huge, you know. Yeah. Yeah. I can't even move this fish. It's so big, us. Unfortunately, Chad lost his big bottom fish, but I remain hooked up. Chad still decided to drop back down his jig and he hooked up a Al Moco Jack. When Chad's fish reached the boat, a little bit of chaos followed. His fish got hooked into my main line with my fish on it. So tensions were a little bit high. I was a little bit on edge. And then to make matters worse, a school of mine, my reached around the boat, which just sent everybody into mass chaos. Oh, 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 pull him, pull. Watch out, Dolphin, behind it! Like a bit, draw, 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 like It's, it's floating, I just need to go on top of it. Ross, come on, drive now. Don't get your jig, man, don't worry. Alright, straight so, Django, straight so. Straight to the island. You're floating up fast now. Come on, big boy. Wolf, let's see you. Big Mike, get the float up. Chad! Okay. Chad! <laughs> you're coming up fast! <laughs> you coming up fast, Chad! <laughs> oh my god, it's a mouse! Look at the bubbles! Bubbles! Get blocked! Get blocked! Oh! 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 Come sideways, that's why he pulled through. Yes, you get his sideways, flat fellas. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, that's amazing. Well done, well done. 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 Well done.
Don't risk it. Take a picture with your drink straight now. Alright, let's go. Yeah, let's go down. Go tie the stick. That's no you group with without doubt one of the best fish I have ever landed jigging and to do it on this day with my friends on a jigging you know it was a big accomplishment of mine so I decided to back off for a little while I'm gonna sit down relax mix a drink and I'm gonna take some footage next thing I see Ross fighting a fish in the bow but he's staying real quiet so your boy jump up I run up in the bow and drop a jig and, I, and I'm looking across at Ross and he's, he's staying real quiet but the fish is fighting a lot and I'm wondering how big is this fish I gotta ask him, he said, you know, Brett, it's a, it's a good sized fish. It's alright. See him struggling a little bit. Fish eventually come up and we start to see some color. Oh, nice group of boys! <laughs> nice group of boys! Yes, Ross! Yeah. <laughs> oh, hot! <laughs> group uh, Bring me the boat so I can take some footage. I'm going around you, though. Go on, honey. As I'm passing my rod around Ross, I get hooked up and I look across to Chad and Chad is also hooked up but he's on a big fish. The church! <laughs> Getting bent in the deep. Ross drops his snowy group in the boat and it's an absolute stud. Woo! Hold him up, hold him up, hold him up, hold him up. Yes, Mike! Money jacked to the side, Nice work, brother. Not long after I get my own in, it's just a little baby snowy grouper. Then I look across at Chad and we start to see some color. And Chad brings a beautiful right, fish to the surface. Oh, he's floating up, Chad. He's floating up, Chad. Floating up, Chad! The groups! I get my group up. The groups! Oh, that <laughs> the groups! Well, nice fish, Chad. Well done. Great, us. Oh, too big. It's too big, Chad. Too... Yes, Chad! Watch yourself. Ross landed a pig grouper. Chad also landed a fat snowy grouper and well me, my fish didn't meet the standard so I had to go back in the cooler, get my old grouper out so that I don't embarrass myself to take some pictures with these killers. Quite often, on days like this, where we have amazing fishing, there's a lot of anticipation from me, and I'm very excited going into one of these trips or one of these days of fishing. I get really nervous, and my body kind of goes into this weird overdrive situation where I'm really nervous, I'm really excited, there's a lot of anxiety, and my body starts to gag uncontrollably. I don't know why, I can't explain it. My friends know about it but it's just something that my body does. And uh, yeah, it happened today. <laughs> I get too excited. Ah! I get too excited. Please make sure that makes the edit. <laughs> today is absolutely amazing so far. So I'm gonna kick back, mix some drinks and let the deep drop guys do some damage. One snowy, two snowies, and one girl. 
a nice group of. <laughs> this is absolutely oh, ridiculous. Ah! Oh. Uh, So the deep drop guys added a couple nice fish to the cooler. We decided to pick up our lines and go and look for a new spot. This time we found a spot that came out of 800 feet straight up to 250 feet of water. So we backed off a little bit, went to about 500 feet and dropped our lines right there. The chooch is on. Nice one. Yeah. Yes, Chad. Biggest silky I've ever seen. On a jig. <laughs> Gregory doesn't have much experience with the slow pitch jigging, but he decides to pick up Ross's combo and give it a go. You all get bites? I jump up on the bow and join him. Not long after, I get a bite, but I get cut off immediately. I assume probably it's a shark, and I go rearing. And this is when it happens. Yes, Gregory! Gregory's fish is giving him quite a fight. And something tells me, Brett, no re your line, pay attention to what's going on here because Gregory's on a solid fish and I need to be getting this on camera. Remember, you can't use hard drive, light line, eh? Just get him off the bottom. Nice fish, though. Smoking? Oh, Greg's have a nice one on. It's smoking. <laughs> It's smoking great! What? It's a big fish! It's a big fish! What? Greg has a mouse on! That's a mouse! Why was? Why did this man was? Greg's hard on a nice one. And you want to drop slow pitch? Well, if that's a redfish, that's bigger than any redfish we could feed today. There's a lot of back and forth, and as the fish is coming, Gregory makes a joke about it being a record redfish. And in case you don't know, redfish in Trinidad is snappers. As we call all snappers redfish. So it's, it's quite funny that he's making a joke when in reality he doesn't even know what he's hooked up to. But we do have a suspicion. Boys, what is going on? Greg's on it. He on it. Greg's on it. Greg's on it. Snapper? <laughs> Big snapper fish. Big snapper fish. How oh, long oh, no, I had to go again? Of course, he's out of smoke. Yeah. He's out of smoking. That fish smoking? Smoke out. Hey, okay, he's coming up. He's coming up? Oh! Greg! Red! Oh red. my god! Red. It's a red. monster red. 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 red! Oh yeah. my god! I tell you all they're in the zone. That is the biggest yellow I ever Yeah, that is the biggest yellow that I ever seen. Horse, how is that even possible? That, that has to be a world record, right? I think so. I think you are up here. Oh my god. You are look at this. Look at this yellow eye. Really look at this yellow eye. Horse. Really oh so my I god. We in the horse, how is this? What is that, horse? That's a real record, right, guys? Gregory. Hey, we in the spot. That how is that even possible, horse? Gregory, that is an amazing fish. That is an absolutely amazing fish. That is the biggest silky I've ever seen in my life. Next side, next side. Oh my god. That is the biggest silky. That is the biggest silky ever. Are you kidding me? Bro, that has to be a world record. I don't know how big these fish get, but I didn't know they got this big. That's insane, Gregory. So this is officially the biggest silk snapper I have ever seen in my life or heard of. Nobody in the boat has either seen or heard of a silk snapper this big. So we're gonna have to dig and find out if this is a potential world record. But the fish biting, so you will record gonna have to wait for now. Boy's gonna drop some line. Chooch. Just stop it, I'll give it a knife. Oh no. Going in the hole? 
Going in, you all? Rough him up, Chuch. Oh, oh, he want to go deep. Rough him up, Chuch. Oh, he's smoking. Big fish, shout out to Big Fish. A real proper fish. Oh, going to the ground. Going to the ground. No! No, 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 no! Oh, that's, that's, how, that's how my own was. That's how my own was. Freeze him. Freeze him. Freeze him. You haven't beat Chad. Wait! <laughs> Yeah, was a chat no one only thing too, you know. That's his retirement line, boy. Yes, you got a reason. Short pub, short pub, short pub. No, no, no. Oh, guys, it. No, guys, it. Guys, it. You're real better than my rough film up now. Oh, that's going to be the biggest group, bro. He Chad is having nothing short of an epic battle with what we assume is a huge grouper. There's been a lot of back and forth and the boys have been a little bit uneasy, but Chad is making some headway on this fish. And finally, we get to see some color. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Hey, bubbles, 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 you're exploding. You f***ing exploding. <laughs> wow! <laughs> On the jig. <laughs> Woo! Yes, Chad. Who jig is that? <laughs> Mine. Ooh. Hey, what the hell is that? I dropped it one time on you. <laughs> Good summary back there, dog! Yes! Chuch! Honey check! Oh! Oh my lord! Oh my lord! Chuch! Chuch! With enough quality fish in the cooler and a lot of time on the clock, we decided to pull up the lines and head back into the beautiful Grand Ans Bay. That way the boys can sit back, mix a drink, relax and take a little swim. After taking a relaxing break, we're gonna head back to the dock now, fillet some fish, and get it prepared for dinner. At Port Louis, there's a restaurant on site, and that's where we decided to cook our fresh group on Snapper. The kitchen did an absolutely outstanding job with the meal, and everybody thoroughly enjoyed it. This has honestly been one of the best trips of my entire life. Between the weather conditions and the absolutely amazing fishing, we really couldn't ask for anything more. This surpassed any expectations we had for this trip. So we're back in Trinidad now, and we have Gregory's little snap on ice still. Now this little snapper is probably gonna be a wheel record, so we need to take some measurements. And we got the official weight on it. The previous weight was 16.4 for the all tackle record. Gregory's fish weighed 20 pounds. So right now this is a pending wheel record. We just need to get some things done. Once we have the certificate in hand, it'll seal the deal. All right, y'all. So it's a couple months later and finally the International Game Fishing Association has approved Gregory's fish as an official all tackle wheel record. I am on the way by him right now and he has certificate in hand. He hasn't opened it yet. So we're gonna go by him, we're gonna open it up, and we're gonna, we're gonna get this thing done, y'all. We're gonna get this thing done. All right, folks, we're by Gregory now, and waiting to see the moment of truth when he opens it up. How long are we waiting on this now? How much months? So one was kind of lost in transit, which we don't know where it is right now, so they resent another one via FedEx. Ah, we're like a badge from a 
But Antonio Baggia. So two batches. The official certificate. This is the one you're eating on. This is the one, Gregory. <laughs> and I think, um, as far as my knowledge goes, there's no trainee that actually has an all tackle wheel record. So, Gregory, as far as my knowledge goes, is the only one, which is a big deal. A big deal. And there it is, y'all. The official IGFA website, Silk Snapper. All tackle record by the one and only Gregory Joseph. Alright folks, hope you enjoyed the video. Alright, we'll catch you guys in the next one.